Good morning, everyone. It is Thursday morning. Uh, I am glad to be here. I hope you're doing well. And um, had a great time last night and the house of the Lord talked about probably one of the most famous and most well-beloved verses of all the Bible in John 3, 16. And the reason why is because, of course, there, there was, there's a promise there. And uh, so we had a great time and I hope you were able to join with us. Well, let's get started this morning in our devotion. As you know, we are talking about Joseph and uh, uh, learning some things from his life. And boy, I tell you, what a dysfunctional uh, family he had. And also, uh, I tell you, he, uh, things are just not getting any, any better for him right now, except this, his relationship with the Lord is not even affected by it not affected by his circumstances, not affected by the fact that he's he's now a slave and he works for Potiphar. And, uh, but uh, if you notice, God has blessed him. And God has, has, he has honored the Lord by his life. And today we're going to see that, that same thing being displayed, that Joseph still honors the Lord. I tell you, you and I, how important it is that we make daily decisions that are right before him. You know, it does matter what you and I choose to do. It's, it, it is a big deal, and it does affect our lives. Well, let's, let's see what, what happens here. The Bible says in Genesis 39 and in verse number 7, And it came to pass after these things that his master's wife cast her eyes upon Joseph, and she said, lie with me. And the Bible says in the next verse, but he refused, but he refused. You know, I tell you, just that alone. And that's what I want to emphasize with you today. And, and that is this, but he refused. He refused um, a situation that could have been so bad but he refused. And, and I tell you, may you and I learn it's okay to say no. I don't care what the culture is doing. I don't care what everyone else is doing. You know, it's okay to say no. It's okay to say, nope, I don't believe that. No, I'm not going to do that. Uh, just because everyone else is, I'm going to say no. You know, you and I ought to say no to the things of this world, though they will be offered to you. But may we always say yes to God and continue to say yes. And by the way, when you and I don't say no, and we should have, you know, may we get things right, right? May we get things right with the Lord. May we confess. May we uh, get it right so that we can do what's right. So Joseph said it like this. No, not going to. Not going to do what? I'm not going to lie with you. I'm not going to do it. And I tell you today, may you and I say no to sin and say yes to God. Let's pray. Father, Lord bless us. Help us to keep our eyes upon you. And Lord, may we May we get things right when we do say, when we do mess up. But Lord, may we be encouraged to do what's right. May we be encouraged today to quit sin and to say no to sin and say yes to you. In Jesus' name, amen. God bless you. Have a wonderful day. We'll talk to you tomorrow.